hey lovelies welcome back to the channel if today is your first time of tuning in you are highly welcome on this channel i do protective hairstyles for kids i do diys i do hair treatment i do a lot on this channel so please consider hitting the subscribe button down below so you can join the family and thank you as you do that so in today's video guys i'll be showing you guys how i made this clove mask for for maxi hair growth that's what we are going to be doing today okay this max right here really helped me in growing my daughter's bad patches this is her hair before and now this clove hair max really helped me in growing her hair so to prepare it you get a blender then you get your cloves then you go ahead and add about two tablespoons of cloves into the blender although you add according to the volume of your hair if your hair is much you have to increase the quantity okay but here i'll be adding two tablespoons of cloves two and a half tablespoons of cloves into the blender then i'll go ahead and blend it so by now i know you you all must have been hearing or must have seen the one that this thing called cloves does to the hair i know you all must have been saying that <laughs> if you are not using clothes on your hair you are missing out so better start now because there are a lot of hair benefits of these um clothes yeah clothes promotes hair growth and adds shine to the hair it helps treat dandruff and prevent premature graying of hair clothes also help to stop hair loss that is the one i can testify this right here helps to prevent hair loss cleans and suits the scalp that one i can testify yeah so after blending it the next thing i will do is that i'll go ahead and add garlic to it and i'll be using these two cloves of garlic i'll be using garlic because the presence of selenium content in garlic helps boost blood circulation for maxi nourishment and growth it also helps to cleanse the hair follicles strengthens them and prevent clogging you know if you really um, want to avoid um, clogging try incorporating garlic to your hair treatment so the next one here is ginger ginger is also very very important when it comes to growing your hair because it helps to improve the circulation of um, blood to the scalp you know ginger has vitamins minerals and fatty acid so they also contribute to strengthen your hair strands to fight hair loss and ginger contributes to restoring your hair moisture so the next one here guys is onion onion is also very good when it comes to growing your hair it helps boost hair growth you know onion minimizes hair thinning it reverses premature graying and also onions can help you treat dandruff yes this i can also testify so the next one here is banana we are going to be using banana also Bananas are very great for your hair and scalp. Banana helps to prevent um, dandruff and uh, moisturizes your scalp. And you know, banana is also rich in potassium and natural oil, you know, which helps soften the hair and protect the natural elasticity of your hair. So after that, the next one we are going to be adding is avocado. Avocado is a very great source of biotin and adding this avocado to your hair treatment can help bring back your hair to life. Yes, <laughs> avocado is very, very good when it comes to maintaining your hair growth. So I added about half of the avocado. Then the next one I'll be adding is egg. Oh, my egg is already broken. <laughs> egg helps you to keep your hair thick and healthy. So after adding the egg, I'll go ahead and cover it and blend until everything, you know, blends very well. So guys, that is it. All the ingredients I added into this treatment are very, very powerful when it comes to restoring your hair growth, you know, um, treating dandruff, 
you know um stopping hair breakage they are very very powerful when it comes to that okay so using this treatment will really help you to stop hair loss will help you to treat dandruff will help you to grow a thicker hair it will also help you to stop hair breakage okay so after blending it the next thing i'm gonna do here is to get a plate then i will use a chiffon cloth i'll place the chiffon cloth on top of the plate then i'll pour in everything into the chiffon cloth if you don't have chiffon cloth you can use a muslin bag or um wig cap a clean wig cap okay so once that is done i will go ahead and uh, and uh, um sieve it you know i'll go ahead and squeeze out the the main thing don't ever try applying this on your hair without show tarring without sieving it first otherwise <laughs> the kind of particles that will be stuck in your hair you in fact you will regret ever using the treatment so it's always good that after blending you strain okay before using it so that you don't get to have particles stuck in your hair okay guys <laughs> so this this process this method right now is very very important it's very very important i must tell you guys make sure you strain yours before you use it okay so that is it guys that is it this is exactly how you make your clothes hair mask that will help you to stop hair loss that will also help you to treat that drop you know um stop hair breakage and all that this is it and this is what it looks like this is very very good this is very very good honestly i would i will advise you all to try this treatment oh my goodness did you see how it looks like did you see did you see how the treatment is looking like so that is it that is basically how you prepare your clothes hair mask okay so now i'll go i'll go ahead and show you guys how you can apply it so this is my daughter this is her hair this is one week after look at the patches look at the board patches this is before and now <laughs> you can see the um you can see the improvement there's a lot of improvement there so i'll go ahead and apply it all over her hair yeah her hair is already washed i've washed her hair before now so before applying this make sure you wash your hair okay don't apply it on a dirty hair no wash your hair then go ahead and apply it then after applying it, you go ahead and use your shower cap and cover it for one hour or more than depending on how long you can wait, okay? But I always like to let it sit for two or three hours before I wash it, I wash it out. So now it's done. I'll cover it with shower cap and after three hours I'll go ahead and wash it out so this is basically how you use this to grow your hair you know three that dwarf and all that so guys if you enjoyed watching this video please kindly give me a thumbs up subscribe comment okay I will see you all in my next one bye